Hey, gorgeous soul. It's my birthday weekend and I've lost my voice and I've got a terrible earache. So I'm going to be doing a general. So unfortunately, you're not all going to get your weekly, although hopefully you're compensated by the fact I got the May monthly out early and you can always listen to the monthly um, video to get what's going on this week. This week is quite an intense week. We have Jupiter squaring Venus on the 16th. And there may be a little bit of um, either overexcitement or push me, pull me when it comes to love relationships. This is a fiery week with Mercury going into Aries and Venus going into Aries. So for all of us, actually, there's this sense of extreme excitement, passion, enthusiasm, and we can channel the cosmic energy into being very, very free spirited and taking a leap of faith. The energy this week is a bit like the fool in the tarot. It's asking us to be joyful and to take risks in a way uh, as if we'd never been hurt in our lives, to be open to possibility, to have faith in our passion, to have faith in our dreams and to go for it. Of course, there is a full blue moon, the second blue moon in Libra. So within the mayhem of all of the fiery energy, there's going to be a big, massive rebalancing moon. This full moon is asking us, well, not asking us, it's probably going to be telling us, it's going to be forcing us to look at what is out of balance in our life. And we're likely to experience on that full moon day something that kind of adjusts our um, journey forward. If you listen to your monthly uh, astrology, it'll tell you which direction to look for where that blue moon is going to hit. But it's definitely going to be quite um, a massive re boosting of your energy but you're going to have to look at what is dragging your energy down where you're going wrong and and what you need to focus on to set yourself straight again the sun is entering taurus this week which is going to be able to ground this fantastic fiery energy as well there's a sort of sense of stability which gives us confidence to take risks and to do what we want to do there's a sense that we want the people around us that are loyal and true and good. And no doubt you'll be hooking up with one of your friends that you feel very close to this week. There's also, on the 22nd, the sun is conjunct Uranus in Taurus. And that's quite a big deal because, you know, this has not happened for a very long time. And there's going to be a big revelation about our future in terms of our sense of security. How secure do you feel in the world? How could you feel even more secure and yet be free-spirited and do what you want? Uranus is going to deliver that message and show you exactly how to do that. Take on the passion and the fire, ground your dreams and balance yourself this week for best results. Please check out the other videos which will give you details. And if you go on my website, horoscope.co.uk or michellenight.com, there's a very, very long and detailed written weekly for you. Lots of love, my darlings. I hope you don't feel too let down. And I'll speak to you soon.
forget my gorgeous soul, please come visit me on Instagram. It's my favorite thing. And I do all this amazing stuff, which I'm sure you will love. I do live stories. Uh, I do pick a tarot card reading on stories. I do tarot card of the day and astrology of the day as well. Um, anyway, I would love to share the love with you. Come meet me.